Narendra Modi led Indian government has deployed more troops in the occupied Kashmir in the name of bolstering the so called security measures ahead of the Indian parliamentary elections and the Hindu Amarnath Yatra in the territory according to Kashmir media service the deployment includes a central reserve police force border security force central industrial force Indu Tibetan border force Shastra Seema Bal and national security guard modi regime is settling the outsiders in the occupied kashmir to change the territory's demography a report released by the research section of kashmir media service today said that snatching the land of the kashmiris and giving it to the outsiders was the main purpose of revoking article 370 and 35a Indian troops in the fresh act of state terrorism martyred two kashmiri youth in the baramulla district According to Kashmir Media Service the youth were martyred by the troops in a fake encounter staged during a cordon and search operation in Uri area of the district all parties Huriyat conference has expressed serious concern over the continued unlawful detention of thousands of the Kashmiris including the pro freedom leaders lamenting that the top Huriyat leaders have been languishing in the new delhi's notorious Tihar jail for over a half of the decade according to Kashmir media service APAC spokesman advocate Abdul Rashid Minhas in a statement issued in Srinagar demanded release of the Huriyat leaders activists and the youths before Eid ul Fitr BJP regime has closed the historic Jamia Masjid on Jumatul Vida the last Friday of the holy month of Ramadan and placed the senior APAC leader Mirwais Umar Farooq under house arrest in Srinagar district according to Kashmir media service the Anjuman Oqaf Jamia Masjid the mosque management body in a statement in Srinagar said that the district magistrate and the police officials visited the grand mosque on Friday morning and ordered them to lock the gates of the Srinagar Jamia Masjid National Conference Vice President Umar Abdullah has targeted the Bharatiya Janata Party holding it responsible for destroying the occupied Kashmir through actions taken on the 5th August 2019 according to Kashmir Media Service Umar Abdullah addressing a meeting of the NC workers at the party headquarters in Srinagar said that the party had been saying time and again that on 5th august 2019 jammu and kashmir was dishonored and robbed